everybody, welcome to Tokyo Creative Play. I'm your host, Emma, and today I'm here with... A guy from abroad in Japan, how you doing? I really bring my energy like that. Raise the energy up because look, it's autumn, and in autumn in Japan, they have food that you can only get in autumn in Japan. Wow. And that is what we've got today, right here. Emma's gone out and bought it with her Tokyo Creative team. We're going to eat things and review them and say what's good and what isn't good in it. Yeah? I should be the presenter for tea. Yeah, you're doing great. Where's no, my for salad? It. Where's my job? You're a day off now. You do. What's, what do you like, Emma? Do you like here? Do you like autumn? I love autumn. Potato, <laughs> pumpkin. <laughs> <laughs> but best flavour. Yeah, let's sweet potato stuff. I like sweet potato. A little bit of pumpkin, well, they're bringing in a little bit of apple and cinnamon. Pumpkin spice latte debuted this year in Japan. Oh yeah. Very exciting, did you have one? Starbucks. Yeah. It's too sugary for me. It's like a <laughs> cup of diabetes. It's it, too good. It's, it's too just, good I, I remember I sit and I was like, <laughs> like, no, not, not for me. I'm a pumpkin spice bitch. Oh, you look like the, you've got the pumpkin spice look going on hey, the hair. Yeah. Right? Anyway, let's eat shit. Didn't I say sweet potato and pumpkin? Didn't I say those words? <laughs> For such a big table, there's like nothing on it now. It's so paltry and underwhelming. Once well, so we've got sweet potato in a bag, it's got written on here, Osusume. Recommendation. From who? From 7-Eleven, because all of these things are from convenience stores. This is also from 7-Eleven. Pumpkin in a bit of plastic, that's for you. And I'll have this one. Thanks, Chris. It's good, isn't it? Yeah, being friends with you is great. Top 10 dog. out of 10, would Osusume. People keep, I've, I've been doing a lot of uh, food eating videos this year. Oh. On my own channel, just stuff with Connor, dog, voice actor, and now this. And every time I do it, people are like, watch it, don't die, Chris, don't eat too much, I want, I want you to live. Don't die. This is just a video. I don't eat this much stuff in everyday life. Well, I probably do, but like, I don't eat that much. Do you know you're eating a sweet potato? Yeah. What is it? It's just like, it's, a, it's, it's actually just a sweet potato. I think the they back. add stuff to it. I think it's like sugary and, but it's mainly just a sweet potato, I'm pretty sure. Mm. This is pumpkin cheesecake. Uh, you what? Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Okay, I just needed to check in. Sometimes you worry me. This is, I guess, cream cheese and kabocha. It's good. Tastes like pumpkin cheesecake. Like a burger rainbow. It's good taste. It's good taste like a <laughs> pumpkin cheesecake. Oh, damn. It's fine. Oh. Nice. It's, 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 it's the trick. I'll give that a 7 out of 10. I'll give this a, maybe a, a, a 6. It's like fine. Mm. It's fine. So you've actually got a product that I do get a lot. This is uh, Mitsuya Cider, apple flavour. And the apples are from Sugaru in Almore, which is a famous apple point. Have you had this before? Yes, I have. When I get the bullet train from Tokyo Station in Sendai, that's like what I get from the vending machines. Every time. You, you like it? I love it. I have also had this. <laughs> I do not like it. Oh really? Yeah. Well, I don't like cafe juice. latte. I don't, I don't, I don't love that. consuming caffeine and milk. And this is just. Why not? It's a great combo. Which which one would you rather have? <laughs> <laughs> it's just so sweet. It's so unnecessarily sweet. I like apple juice with fizzy thingy. I, I don't need it to be juice and then added sugar. You know, it's just and also the text. I'm particularly angry about this beverage. I'm surprised that you like it. Yeah. The amount of text on the bottle is criminal. It's like just a yeah. Chris, come on, come on, Chris. <laughs> Prove to the people that you're right. you go. stupid. <laughs> come on, go in now. Bounce straight off. Oh. There you go, the violence, the sheer violence. That was the most depressing thing I've seen all year. <laughs> That's how I feel with every video I release. <laughs> it does taste like maple. Maple leaves. Maple tree. It's just so sweet, man. What's your favourite place to travel in autumn? Anywhere where there is leaf. Is what? Leaf, nice leaf to look at. Right. Yeah. Such as? Uh, mountain. No, like a... Wait, let's, let's, Nik let's be a little bit more specific. Nico's nice. Nikko. Um, I've still never been to Nikko. What's wrong with you? I, it's weird, I like, the bullet train between Tokyo and Sendai goes straight through it and I just can't be bothered to get off. You're a silly man. I know, but I've heard good things about it in autumn. I, I do like Kyoto in autumn. Yes. Yeah, I, like, autumn's my favourite season in Japan. People always ask, when's the best time to come to Japan? I always say autumn. Best temperature, best scenery, perfect. Yeah. yeah, I agree with that. You can drink the maple latte as well from Mount Rainier, mm. from Seattle. I always prefer autumn flavoured things to cherry blossom flavoured things, you know, because mm. you get different snacks each season. During cherry blossom season, they're just so... Uh, no, no, not for me. But, but they put a potato in it. <laughs> I'm happy, girl. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> I mean, this is this is from America, isn't it? Mount Rainier coffee. Is this it's even it's Japanese? It's Seattle. Seattle, isn't it? Tastes good. The, the flavour is six, and because I like Seattle, I'll give it an extra point, seven out of ten. I know you're gonna, you'd want to rate this higher, but I actually specifically hate this drink. Why did you did not drink this one? That's I would have That's gone dairy. It was like that. coffee. Yeah, but uh, this affects nine out of ten. Oh, it's like three out of ten. Oh dear. Yeah, I really, oh dear. I really don't like it. You're fine. Damn. Yeah. No, <laughs> shut your Chris. Sweet potato crisps. They are potato chips made from sweet potatoes. They're slightly thicker, and they taste. Ow. Oh, look, the, the material they used to build the space shuttle. Oh. So hard. Oh my god. They're always like, sweet potato is so hard. Who eats this? Who like goes out of the way and thinks, yes, I'll smash my teeth to pieces? I have three colours of sweet potato fries. Uh, red. Jacobi. Oh, from, these, from are, what these are very pleasant. Never mind, they're, they're just potato, they're not sweet potato, they're just different colours. Try this. I Shatter your teeth. <laughs> Shatter your dreams. And Try a bloody nice. sweet potato thing. Oh, that's good. Mm. You can hear your teeth like breaking apart. It's an aggressive chip. Yeah, I, like, I quite like those. They're pretty nice. Yeah, these are good. Why is it? This one. Mm. I'm not so sure about the purple colour. Why is it purple? For fun. You know what that is, Chris? No. No, I don't know. <laughs> I've come to learn today. So go creative. I give that an 8 out of 10 out of 3 out of 10. This makes me upset. This Why does it make you upset, Emma? It's the most insane collaboration. It's like, okay, so this is Topo, right? Topo! Topo! It's a very posh David Attenborough product, isn't it? Well, Topo. it's like anti Pocky. What do you call it? Like, anti Pocky. Inver <laughs> inverted evil Pocky. You know, it's like in inverted. It's on the inside. Chocolate and stuff's on the inside. Yeah. But it's a, it's Topo X Satsumariko, which is Satsumaimo, which is sweet potato, and Niko from Jagariko, which is the potato sticks. So they're doing a thing called Satsumariko, which is sweet potato sticks for autumn, and now they're doing a collaboration with this, and it's too much! It's, like, it's just like E equals MC squared level of scientific shit. Like, chill out. But, I mean, is it good? Well, I guess we'll have to find Have you had it before? I have not. What have you got? I've got Look. So Look is like the cheapest chocolate brand in the world. A lot, like, they're kind of good chocolate. You know, like, cheap chocolate tastes good as you would have experienced on uh, Valentine's Day or White Day earlier this year when I made oh, yeah. new chocolate along with uh, Charla and Aki. But no, look, is uh, they have like little weird exciting flavours. The flavour of this one is of course sweet potato again, because autumn equals sweet potatoes. Again. It smells very sweet potato-y. It smells very sweet potato-y and yeah, little chocolate. Oh, oh we've got sweet potato and daigaku mo flavour, which is sweet potato candied with Sweet stuff. And for the record, it doesn't work. Oh. I, uh, I peaked okay. years ago. I did a Halloween like costume. I peaked years ago. I peaked. I had Halloween <laughs> peak. You know when you do something so great, you, you know you can't do it again. Yeah. When you go to a Halloween party, you have to wear a costume, right? Mm -hmm. And the costume I went to, I, I went to this party and I dressed up as. I, I had like no time left. I had to like quickly race to get a costume together. And I went to Daiso with about a hundred dollars. Oh and I bought all the candy that I could buy. And then I had stuck it to myself. And I got like a little top hat and a candy cane. And I went as the candy man, which is a character I think, in hindsight, I created that night. <laughs> yeah. When I thought it was actually a, a thing. No, candy man. And everyone could eat my costume. So oh. at the end of the night, my costume was gone. And I won the award, even though the costume had gone at that point. Wow. I won the award for best costume, so. Awesome. I can't, I know I can't ever top that again, so I can't ever go to the Halloween party again. That's sad, but yeah. noble and understandable. And mental. Uh, no, I would give that a <laughs> 4 out of 10. It doesn't really work. I'm so sick of sweet potato things. I would give this a, maybe just a 5. It's like, yeah, I can keep eating it, but I'm not like excited about it. Yeah, sweet potato's got a really distinct smell, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Next. I've now got apple, cinnamon, and Kit Kats. I'm excited, it's not sweet potato. Why do you keep yeah. getting the good products? I've got sweet potato <laughs> crackers. I haven't had Kit Kats in a while, and uh, I always get people shout at me for not eating it right, so I'm gonna do it right. How, do you, snap eat, it how do you eat it? Well, because these are like, like but, yeah. children's size, you can like shot it in one, but you can't do that with Kit Kats, so you have to split it right. Mmm, yeah. it's good. I actually like that. Mine's really nice. Mine's a bit like apple cider. Mm. Apple cider. That's really good. Yeah. Oh, like, a, like a 9 That's, out of 10? That is one of the best flavours of Kit Kats I've yeah. ever had, I think. And I've had like 286 flavours, so... It's really good. 9 out of 10. Mm. The only flavour that's better is sake flavour. You like that one? You don't, then? 
the, the patronite. You like that one? Right, I'll have a Kit Kat. You can have the bloody dry as anything biscuits, crackers. Thanks, Chris. <laughs> Might be a Kit Kat. <laughs> Don't fill out my mouth. What about the cotton? Oh, they put like the stuff on the outside. It's the goodest, best it's thing ever. It's so sad to go to this after that. I never really, like, these are like a mix between like sweet and salty. It's like a sugary outside, but there's a lot of salt going on. Yeah, it's fine. This is like, you can't taste the potato too much. This is like the good Halloween party that you're going to, and this is like my Halloween party. <laughs> this is just me and a room getting drunk with some cider. Um, all right, here we go. Look at that. Caked in some Mystery. sort of mystery. mystery. That's that really great YouTube channel, mate. Yeah. <laughs> Toggy Gocky Traveler's new channel, Caked in Mystery. Mystery. It's where you make cakes and fill it with things, and people have to guess what it is mm. while eating it with a blindfold. You can't open it, it's just like baked beans. It's fine. It's alright, I'll give it like a four. Yeah. I'm just gonna say four. It's not as dry as I thought it would be. Four. Next! Four. Oh yeah! <laughs> what have we got now? Kabocha. Pumpkins in dis despair. What's that? Chai tea. tea! It's soy milk. So these uh, Kikoman soy milks come out with different flavours every season, and this time they've gone for chai tea and pumpkin. I've never had one of these before. This is like the thing you see in the convenience store more than anything, and I've never ever had it. Actually? Ever, actually, never, ever, and because it looks like a children's thing, a children's drink basically, and it tastes like an atrocity. It's really bad. It's awful. It's, it's really quite bad. It's like, imagine milk that's gone off, and somebody's like spilt their like ink in it or something. It's, it's, ink? It's, it's shit. It tastes like pumpkin flavouring. What's the amount of juice? I think it's got like four percent pumpkin in it. I could be wrong. It's got pumpkin powder in it. Pumpkin powder. Mm. It's not like a smoothie. It's just flavoured milk. Mine's quite nice. Mm. Yeah, a little bit of cinnamon. It's a bit sweet, but uh, it's nice. It's a nice little fix if you want some soy milk on the go. So you can put this in the microwave for one minute fifty. That's a long time. And you can heat up the disappointment and drink it hot. So three out of ten. Why not? I'll go for a seven out of ten. Should I like it? So there's a, there's a little smiley pumpkin there. Oh, it's oh, we, actually that's really cute. Smiling. Yours is very cute. Nice, nice happy flavour. Yeah. You're gonna change your score because it's cute. The score's gone down to so two out of ten. No. Right? Next. For fuck's sake, <laughs> it's now a tube of sweet potato. How many times do I have to eat sweet potato? This video might as well be called Abroad in Japan versus Sweet Potato with Australian girl. And what? This is a pancake, right? Dorayaki, yeah. Right. Pancake with bean in the middle, unless they've replaced it with sweet potato. <laughs> Is it actually? Oh, it looks like they've put uh, chestnuts in the middle. Chestnut dorayaki, thank god for that. I've got uh, this like sweet potato <laughs> and red bean. I used to buy these actually when I lived in my tiny apartment. I was so excited, I go to the, the you, grocery store. Do you live in a tiny apartment now? That's a secret. Isn't your video like, yeah, I live in a big house now? Yeah, I know, I live in a in a bigger place. Oh, so. I know. I remember the days getting started now, the tiny apartment videos. Yeah. How many, it was three tiny apartments? Uh, no, it was mainly like the tiny apartment. Oh. And then I like gradually upgraded to like uh, smallish apartments. <laughs> and now I'm <laughs> like. Tiny, small, moderately small. <laughs> yeah, like Get my average bigger. size apartment. So, how would you brand your current apartment? Nice. Nice apartment. Modern, modern, nice modern apartment. fresh uh, Japanese. The tiny apartment days behind you. I know. Oh. I'm irrelevant. Now I just live a normal <laughs> life. I always feel kind of weird because clearly it's shaped like people have done this with their fingers. Have they actually? Well, look at it. It fits. It fits fingers perfectly. <laughs> so it's clearly shaped by someone going. <laughs> like, it's not like supposed that. to be like that. It's the person that works at the factory is just like. <laughs> I mean, Death, sweet potato. At a reasonable price. There's mochi on the inside. This is Super worse bad. than I remember it being. I can't get this tube of crap. Open. I think when I moved here, I was so excited to be in Japan that I could eat things and be like, wow, this is great. When in reality, it's not that. I mean, it's enjoyable. It's Enjoy. fine. Yeah. No. Did they change the flavour? They put things in it. They put chunks of something in it. <laughs> I don't even want to eat it. I don't want to eat it. I'll eat it. But I've come down on a bullet train like an hour and a half just to eat this. So I have to eat it, don't I? Yeah. I'm not the biggest fan of Doriaki. It's a bit of hit and miss. I like the ones that are fresh. I mean, these ones that are kind of wrapped like this, this was probably made in like 1974. <laughs> but. The fresh ones that are like cream and strawberries and fun inside. Yeah. They're the good ones, right? Alright, go for it. Crack it open. It's like a tube of 
disgusting. Oh. I feel bad because a lot of people out there love Japanese sweets and a lot of them are really good. It's just, it's just a lot. <laughs> I, 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 no, Emma. No. Don't defend it. Oh, it's like what my arteries probably look like on the inside oh after eating God. all this food today. Just that. It literally, like, yeah. I'll give that a nothing out of 10. I'll give that a 5 out of 10. It's a 4 out of 10. I'm starting to hate autumn. <laughs> Everything about it. <laughs> So for the last one, TC have rolled out the big guns. We've got autumn flavoured yeah. Kirin beer. Um, every year, since 1991, Kirin bring out like a special autumn flavour. Uh, and basically this one's got 1.3 times the amount of hops, so it's a bit more hoppy, wow. shall we say. Nice. But um, it's exciting, there's not a single sweet potato in sight. <laughs> Thank God. Yes, let's go. What have you got? I've got some rich chestnut ice cream from Hagen Dazs. I was excited, I, for some reason I looked upside down and it says Nipti and I was like, oh, lychees? And then I was like, oh, it's chestnut. I don't know why I got it, so I was like, that's so different, that's, I'm not, oh, it's, it's a... This is really good, it's um, got a sort of distinct flavour, it's, it's more malty, shall we say? Um, Whoa. Mm. Whoa. Well, I love the branding, every year when you sort of go to a convenience store, the the beers, this this brand, it's slightly subtly changed the designs and stuff, and uh, yeah, it's nice. This is for me. This is what autumn's all about. Alcohol. This one, the flavour is way different than what I expected. It is a really strong flavour, but it's nice. I I don't know. This I'm glad I can now cleanse my palate after eating all the sweet potatoes in Japan ever. Nine out of ten. Thank you, Kirin. Uh, well done. This Ooh. is this is good. Uh, again, it is chestnut flavour. It's uh, 7 out of 10. 7 out of 10. 7 out of 10. Nice, it's good. Good. Well, when you come to Japan, when airplanes exist again, <laughs> then, or when, so Japan's going to open hopefully in April, fingers crossed, I think it was 80% chance. So yeah. you can book your flight in April, be here for autumn, and uh, try the beer. But thank you for having me down here. It's always a pleasure, Emma. No worries. I'm glad that, that we could feed you. Absolutely, and, uh, absolutely. It was a lot of fun. Have a fun time together. I just, it, I just, the whole seasonal thing in Japan is a funny thing. They always like, it's four seasons in Japan. <laughs> but to be fair, Australia, you don't really have four distinct yeah, seasons. Yeah, it's right? like green and then brown. <laughs> <laughs> well, I do like the way they have these sort of seasonal products and seasonality. You do see a lot of distinct changes around Japan. Definitely. And, uh, autumn is the time to come. Remember that. Right on your wall. Let us know in the comments down below uh, which snack you would like to try and if you actually do enjoy sweet potato. I don't know who you look at. Nobody likes sweet potato. No. My it's... mum does. Do you not like my mum, Chris? So, uh, my relationship with your mum is <laughs> taking a sharp <laughs> turn downwards. <laughs> it's a sad, sad way to end the video, but that's the way it's ending. That's ended. the way it's going to be. Goodbye, Can't everybody. Really. Bye. Oh, no. Oh, no. <clears throat> Oh, <laughs> Is it going to be like a winter edition? Sure, why not? Eat like a bag of snow. No! Well, I don't want to eat it.